I have just created the most perfect outfit. Ah, some of you guys intrinsically knew that something was missing there. Let me guess, it was almost as like looking at a drink without garnish or looking at the Mona Lisa and she has no eyes. That's such a terrible comparison. Accessories, if you guys guessed accessories was missing, you were right. Accessories are just another form of self-expression. Little pieces of gold here and there can really make a huge impact on the aesthetic of your outfit. So what accessories do you choose when there is millions of different styles to choose from? Well, whenever starting anything brand new, you always wanna start off with the basics. And the basics in our case is simplistic jewelry designs that you can wear every single day, no matter the outfit. Nothing with crazy designs, just something with clean angular lines. Now your next question may be, what color do I go for? Do I go for gold or do I go for silver? Well, according to every guide ever, there is a metal that complements your skin more than the others. So the way you figure out what metal complements your skin is by going into some natural light. And what you're gonna do is take a look at the veins in your wrist. And when you look at your veins in your wrist, do they appear more green or do they appear more blue? If your veins appear more green, that means you have a warmer skin tone and gold is more suitable for your skin tone. If your veins appear more blue, that means you have a cooler skin tone and silvers look better on your skin. But I don't follow any of that shit. I literally wear gold, I wear silver, I like both. So really it doesn't matter, just wear whichever one you like. And the next thing is how much jewelry should you wear? Well, that totally depends. If you tend to dress more formally, maybe you just wear a ring and a watch. Or maybe you're on the complete opposite end of the spectrum where you go for a biker look and five rings, three necklaces, and a bracelet is more suitable for you. Or maybe you're right in the middle where you just go for an elevated casual outfit like myself and maybe that's two necklaces and two rings. Like I said, it totally depends on the aesthetic you're going for as well as your design choice. Thankfully, there are brands that will literally make any design that you are looking for according to your style. If you're into minimal jewelry, maybe take a look at Men's Sai and Degs and Cell. They, they should have you covered there. Maybe you're into unique designs ranging from doves to Tudor royalty. Then you'd go for something like Serge de Nimes. Maybe you're like the biker dude that I was talking about earlier, then clocks and colors is more suitable for you. Or you just don't even know what you like yet and you want something that's affordable that looks somewhat nice. And then you've got Crafted London and Vitaly. Either way, there's something out there for everyone. I think the only wrong answer when it comes to accessories is to wear literally none. <laughs> so if you guys enjoyed today's straight to the point, non-BS video, please drop a like and subscribe to the channel and I'll catch you guys in the next video. See ya!